understanding the Manupatra feature, legal taxonomy. Manupatra is the most comprehensive legal research database in India, combining the latest legal technology with research and analytical tools to provide cutting edge features to its users. Legal taxonomy is one of the many. This is how legal taxonomy looks like. It is available through the table of contents found in the left panel. It would open a list of subjects as has been displayed here. You can click on the plus icon to find the list of subtopics. If you want to go to a judgment under a subtopic, you have to click on the play button provided next to it. What exactly is legal taxonomy? It provides a hierarchical structure that lists lots, topics and subtopics under them. Each topic covered broadly reflects the terms associated with it as the user might find in major textbooks, helping the user in choosing keywords consistently and appropriately for research as well as help you pr prepare for a particular subject for your exam. Once the user chooses a topic, it shows them all the related judgments. This helps them navigate to cases that related to a particular subject area without going through the whole process. How to use legal taxonomy? To use the legal taxonomy feature, you can access it from the table of contents in Manupatra. Select the act, law, subject that you're looking for. Click on it to find all the relevant terms and concepts available as subtopics over there. Click on any of them to find the list of the most important judgments there under. All the judgments are hyperlinked to expand to whichever particular judgment you want to read further. Also to be noted, judgments appearing under each subtopic is not an exhaustive list of judgments on that topic. These are considered important by our editors as well as are the landmark judgments on the subject area. To look for more judgments, you can use the Cited in Manu feature, which is provided with all the judgments on Manupatra. This will give you a list of judgments where the subject judgment has been cited in, so that you can identify similar cases easily. Now we'll look at a live demo on the Manupatra website. To access legal taxonomy, you can click here in the left panel under the table of contents. Once we click on it, a list of topics come. All the subjects under the Indian laws are present here. For this demo, we we'll look at the constitution of India. We click on the plus icon here. It will give you a list of subtopics under the constitution of India. We'll look at the fundamental rights over here. Click on this icon. We find all the rights displayed as further subtopics. For that, we'll look at right to equality. You can find another list of all the subtopics under the right of equality. And the keywords are appearing here, as you can see. Now, we'll look at equality before law. Again, this would give a list of judgments under equality before law, as well as with the subject matter. So for contract, there is NTPC limited and others. We can look at this case by clicking here. This would take you to the list. Here is the judgment from Delhi High Court. You can further go and read the judgment if you wish. To recap legal taxonomy, it provides a list of the most important judgments on a particular subject of the act in point. It finds key concepts, terms in an act to find keywords for better research. All the judgments are hyperlinked to expand whichever particular judgment you want to read further. Thank you for watching this video and I hope it was helpful. If you have any queries, you can write to us at contact at manupatra.com or give it in the comment section provided below. Thank you so much for watching.